Welcome back to Psychology of the Unknown, where we talk about true crime, serial killers, the paranormal, and psychology. So if that's the kind of stuff you're into, then make sure you stab the subscribe button and burn the notification bell so you don't miss out on a single video. Also make sure you give this video a like and leave your manifesto in the comments below. Today I'll be giving you a rundown of the top 10 bloodiest serial killers in history ranked by victim count. So let's begin. Yeah, we don't want to do anything to scare your children. That's the last thing we want to do. We don't want to scare anybody. Coming in at the number 10 spot is Soviet serial killer Andrei Chikatilo, who took 53 confirmed victims with a possibility of 56 between 1978 and 1990. Chikatilo performed cannibalism, necrophilia, evisceration, and mutilation on his victims. The predator who became known by such names as the Butcher of Rostov, the Red Ripper, and the Rostov Ripper preyed on children and young vagrants, eating intimate parts of their bodies. He was sentenced to death on October 15, 1990. At number 9 is American serial killer Samuel Little, who killed 60 confirmed victims, but claimed to have killed up to 93 between 1970 and 2012. Little murdered women across the United States via kidnapping, beating, and then strangling them. He has been known by two other names, Samuel McDowell, as well as the Choke and Stroke Killer. He died on December 30th, 2020. At number 8 is Chinese serial killer Yang Xinhei, who took 67 victims by murder and 23 by rape between 2000 and 2003. Other names he was referred to by in the media were the Monster Killer and the Monster Henan. At night, he would enter his victims' homes and kill all of the occupants, who were mainly farmers, with axes, hammers, and shovels sometimes killing entire families in the process. He was executed by firing squad on February 14, 2004. Coming in at number 7 is a serial killer from India by the name of Kampatamar Shankarya, who killed 70 confirmed victims by way of hitting them with a hammer on the neck below the ears, which gained him the moniker Kanpatamar, which translates as one who hits under ear, between 1977 and 1978. He was executed by hanging on May 16, 1979. Taking the number 6 spot is Brazilian serial killer Pedro Rodriguez Filho, who killed 71 confirmed victims, with 47 of them being prison inmates, with a possible 100 plus more between 1967 and 2003. He's become known as the Brazilian Dexter. He was sentenced to 128 years in prison, but was released in 2018 due to the maximum time an individual can serve in prison in Brazil being 30 years. In 5th place is Daniel Carmago Barbosa, who killed 72 confirmed children and women in Colombia, Ecuador, and Brazil between 1974 and 1986, with a total unconfirmed rape and murder victims, possibly being around 180. He was murdered in jail on November 13, 1994, by the nephew of one of his victims. Number 4 is Russian serial killer and rapist Mikhail Popkov, better known as the werewolf and the Angarsk maniac who killed 83 plus victims between 1992 and 2010. He was apprehended on June 23, 2012 and sentenced to life in prison. In at number 3 is Pakistani serial killer Javed Iqbal, who raped and murdered 100 confirmed boys ranging in age from 6 to 16 between 1998 and 1999. He was sentenced to death by hanging and the execution was carried out on October 8, 2001. The serial killer on this list with the second highest highest kill count is that of Pedro Lopez, who raped and murdered 110 confirmed girls between the ages of 8 and 12 between 1969 and 1979, but confessed to doing the same to at least 300 others. He is better known as the Monster of the Andes. His crimes took place in Colombia, Peru, and Ecuador. He was arrested in 1980, but released by the government of Ecuador in 1998. He is currently wanted by the police for another murder. The serial killer with the highest murder count is child murderer, torture killer, and rapist known as La Bestia, translated to the Beast in English, Luis Garavito. 
the number of confirmed victims he took between 1992 and 1999 was 138. He confessed to 140, but estimates are that he may have killed well over 300 victims. His crimes were committed in Colombia, Ecuador, and Venezuela. He was sentenced to 1,853 years in prison, which was reduced. He is currently held separately from other inmates out of fear that they would kill him instantly. So there you have it, the top 10 bloodiest serial killers with the highest body count in the world. Be sure to check out the other videos on our channel as we do more top 10 similar to this one, as well as true crime, the story of specific serial killers, the paranormal, and psychology. If you found this video interesting, give it a like. Also, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell, share, and comment below. I've been Shannon, and this has been Psychology of the Unknown.